What are your names? Tower. We're learning about this. Uh, I'm Ethan. This is Michelle. Yeah. And who are your muses? I mean, can it hear us for me? My muses. My muses. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I'm, supposed to, I'm supposed to have a, an, a, a ready answer at the, yes. for this sort of thing. There's so many muses. Okay, who are you looking world? forward to meeting at the conference? You might have to interview someone else. <laughs> and I haven't had my first cup of coffee. Elizabeth Stroud, Elizabeth Stroud. I'm having, I'm having lunch with, I'm at her table. I've never yes, met her. Yes, actually, and you know what's interesting about Elizabeth Stroud is Elizabeth Stroud's mother was my high school English teacher. Oh, cool. At Oyster River High School in oh, New Hampshire. And I think Elizabeth must have gone there as well, although she would have been a few years before myself. So I'm looking forward to meeting her and throwing that piece of information. <laughs> can I borrow that so that I can <laughs> have it in? Well, yeah, 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 you can tag along. Yeah, we'll go, we'll go. My we'll go. mother too. Do either of you own a digital reader? No. No. But I'm not against them. And top three words that come to your mind when you think of the future of publishing? Scary. Um, no pay. <laughs> That's three words. Uh, experimental, promising, uh, influential. Great. I have a much more positive look on publishing than most people. I had. I mean, I, to, to get back to the question about the digital reader, I don't. I don't have. A, I, I've never used one myself. But I had a, a person approach me, wanting me to sign their Kindle. 